Nomad versus Settler. Thank you for being part of Advocate Sessions. Thank you guys. <laughs> <laughs> um, you guys are awesome. I wasn't expecting that, so it was really good. <laughs> I dig your style. Thank you so much. So can you guys um, tell us a little bit, like a backstory behind how you guys met, how you guys formed? Backstory? Yeah, it's kind of... It kind of started with the uh, sort of just a, a simple, it's just little like coffee shop tuck and patty type thing. It's just me and Ray playing yeah. like <laughs> covers of like songs and stuff. And uh, and then you know we had a I had this little gig at this at this party, and then Owen was there. So yeah. and he's like, you guys probably seem like you need a bass player, right? Yeah. So um, he joined us. He joined us, and then um, we met yeah. Milu playing through a battle of the bands in uh, Brattleboro. A couple years ago, and then uh, kind of went from there, and we've been playing ever since. So it's been about two, three years now. Yeah, I believe. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> we definitely have a bunch of different influences. You can tell in the music, <laughs> which is great. Thank you. Um, are there any specific interests or bands that you pull influence from? Um, for me, I don't know. In the beginning, when I began writing for Envious, a lot of uh, my influence came from bands such as like. Arctic Monkeys and Royal Blood, very like rock. Um, but lately, honestly, I've gotten more into pop. Um, but I also really like uh, singers like Amy Winehouse and Rachel Price from Lake Street Dive. I pull a lot of influence from Lake Street Dive. But what about you, Archer? Me? I don't know, like Wes Montgomery, Charlie Parker. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, I listen to a lot of. I'm just always. Recently, I've just been kind of fascinated with how like I think specifically with guitar there's a lot of there's a lot of dimensions uh, sometimes like just like I love playing different lines at the same time just sitting down and having like set a bunch of things in motion at once and a lot of players players like uh, Joe Pass and uh, and players like Jimmy Weibel and John Stoll more obscure people like who kind of improvise counterpuntally and I think my role in the band is not always to do everything like that myself, but I always try to, when I'm playing with these guys, I try to think about what do I think this needs that is not happening, and I will have that. So it's kind of like a, sometimes I think of it as almost like a counterpoint to everything else, just about listening. Um, uh, so I try to pull those influences in there in that way. Do you have um, any new music in the works? Or are you going to Yeah, we do. Soon? Yeah, yeah. Um, we recorded March of 2016, I believe, right? At um, Guilford Sound in Guilford, Vermont. Um, and we came out with an EP of about five songs, one of which Dust to Dust is on. Um, and we are hoping to come out with a, another album or a set of recordings um, sometime in the spring. We haven't started on anything yet, but We've got some ideas. Um, we're trying to write a lot of new stuff, like songs like Hollow Ground and 26 Gasoline Stations, our first and last song. Um, we've had a lot of more music produced uh, around that genre. And we also are hoping to record some old ones, like Crying in the Rain, the second to last one we played. So, yeah. <laughs> now, do you guys have any um, gigs coming up in December or the beginning of the year? Um, well, we, we've been trying to definitely write more so that's mainly our focus but um we actually have a show at the stone church in brad river Vermont, oh, cool. um saturday november 25th i think it's like five dollars to get in it's with um some other local bands from brad river and uh yeah so we're we're excited for that i think it's for a benefit for a local uh radio station around so yeah i think yeah. um I think december 1st is when Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, thanks so much for per performing, and glad to have you on. Thank you so Thank much. You. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.